Hello everyone, got another post bag video for you today from stuff. Yeah. Hello everyone, got another AliExpress post bag video for you today. As usual, I will go through the stuff that I've got from AliExpress. I will explain what they are, I will explain what I'm going to use them for, and I will put a link to the items in the description below. Got quite a few things in and got quite a big thing as well. Seems to be well wrapped. Uh, so let's go take a look. Let's get stuck in. This one first. Okie dokie. Actually, before we start, I'm going to shame my fiance who was using my cutting mat to make a brooch bouquet, but she decided to turn it into a gluing mat and left all the hot glue all over my mat. Great stuff. Thank you. Okay, what have we got? Um, this is another soldering kit. Uh, it is a 555 uh, water light, water flow LED kit. Uh, it's a mixture of SMD and through hole uh, LEDs, some a 555 timer and be a shift register. Uh, and yeah, it's just a little kit. You power it up and I imagine the lights will flicker on and off, on and off in a water flow pattern that the Chinese seem to like to call it. Uh, yeah, that's following on for my soldering uh, practices. I'll get a little video of this little kit. Maybe call it a lazy Monday. Maybe not infringe on David's, uh, David's videos. But here is tiny. Anything in it? There we go. Aha! Ah, needed this. Open it. This is a micro SD to USB adapter. Um, I have been using transferring files from a micro SD card, it's been using the, an SD, uh, normal SD card adapter, but my laptop for some reason doesn't like it. Uh, and it will just randomly uh, not see the card and it won't read the cards or read it for a bit and during a transfer it will just say nope not having it uh, so it's a real pain um, so I do have one of these somewhere but I can't find it and I thought I know go on AliExpress and get myself another one uh, so yeah and it's USB 3 apparently whether it's just blue USB 3 or if it's an actual USB 3 transfer we'll find out um, got a card and it just slots in Diddy, like that. Very handy, very small. Always need one of these. Cooling. And it was dirt cheap, as always. Don't lose that, tiny. <whistles> these, aha. Yes, this is a set of five. Uh, lithium ion battery charge boards and protection circuits uh, these are just the standard boards that you can get on aliexpress and uh, ebay and amazon and, and whatnot uh, it's for a single um, single lithium ion uh, board uh, battery it's got the charging circuit uh, but it also has a protection circuit uh, which is these two little mosfet and a protection circuit which Protects on overcharge, discharge, undercharge, overcharge, one balloon free, all that kind of stuff. Um, these connections are micro USB. I thought I had some of these. I was doing a project. Um, where is it? It is this. What is it? It is a picture frame. No, the backlit picture frame is actually for a litho plane, which is a 3D printed picture, which will go on the front. And you shine light through it and the picture appears. It's from my mum. Um, but I created this um, back to it. So it sits like that and shines. 
Wee, and it is insanely bright. Oh my god. Oh. I'm actually using this as one of my uh, studio lights. Pretty, pretty handy. Uh, but it runs off. Wow, that's so bright. Um, two uh, 18650 batteries. Uh, this is a crude little booster board because uh, I thought I had some uh, boost boards, but I didn't. Uh, and there is the charge. You can see it. You can see the charging and protection circuit. But it is micro. No, it is mini. Um, I thought I had micros, but I didn't. So I ended up using a mini, um, which is bigger. See the difference there. Uh, which for my mum is probably better because uh, it's a chunkier cable uh, the mini USB uh, and it slots in better uh, but then I realized I needed some of these so I got them it's a cool little switch take off with this I might do a video on this it's a bit of a private project so I might not but you never know let's leave it on as a cool light we it's really bright so it's a five volt Strip. What have we got next? Uh -huh. Another useful little development board. This is a uh, development board for ESP eighty two sixty six. Um, it's basically a USB to serial. Um, device now this is actually a programmer uh, with the ESP8266 it boots up uh, in run mode but if you want to flash it you have to uh, I think you have to pull GPIO 00 I believe to ground and hit the reset pin now in a previous video I'll stick up there uh, I got one of these I thought I got a programmer but it turns out it was just a serial uh, USB to serial board you can't actually program with it because it doesn't put the ESP8266 into program mode uh, you could do a few hacks and put it on a breadboard or you could attach a switch essentially you're replicating this let me find it here it is still with it on so the difference between these two is it has a switch and this allows you to put it into flash mode or run mode or boot mode and run mode whereas this one doesn't it does have a nice big fat capacitor uh, to help with the power management uh, to reduce all the power spikes which the ESP chip hates uh, this one doesn't so I don't know how stable it's going to be but it does allow you to program it I'm going to do a video about this I think because I didn't know about that and I was all ready to program it and you can't uh, and the ESP sits on the top. Ooh, tight fit on. And there you go. Plug it into your computer. You can run it. You can program it. I think the chip has text on it. Yeah, UART and program. Very cool. Very flat. Ah, I know what these are. Ha 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 ha. Let me get these out without showing you. These. Ta da! These are post it notes or sticky notes if you don't want to get uh, sued by 3M. Uh, and they are um, XP style computer geeky. Cool. You know the drill. Sticky notes, errors, errors, warnings, delete all, delete, stick a bit of a note on. Very geeky, very cool. Right up my street, I saw them and I had to have them. And they were about 60p delivered, something like that. Crazy cheap. God knows if they got the permission from Microsoft to copy all this. I imagine not. But yeah, pretty cool. Ah, 
and the final bag. Well wrap this. Uh -huh. Oops. My super special light. What have we got here? This is EL wire. Get rid of this crinkly wrap. This is EL wire. Uh, which is basically like, we'll call it neon wire or glow up wire. Uh, it's basically I mean, it's phosphorus coated wire that you run a iso uh, oscillating voltage on and it lights up. And this is two meters of pink EL wire. I had to get pink because I am having twin girls soon. Very exciting and the only way to get this past my fiance was to say it was something to do with the girls. Um, which I'm sure it will be. Make a great dummy or something maybe. Um, let me get a battery. And this is a control box. So uh, this is supposed to be sound activated. So I believe that's a little microphone to make it flash. And it's got a few mode buttons and a um, sensitivity dial for the sound. And it is two double A's by the looks of it. Let me go get two double A's. Two double A's. Kodak. Wow, do you remember them that used to make cameras? Pop them in. I'll turn my super duper light off. Whoa, that is dark. You connect it. You don't need to buy this board. Uh, you can uh, hook it up to other um, power sources and run Arduino uh, sketch you through it to open it up uh, but this is just a handy way of having it available for use so mm, check it out not very pink when it's lit up right, press the mode button flashes Aha. Uh -huh. It's off. On. Flashing. Sound activated. So. Hello. This is the sound of my birth. Beep, beep. As you turn this down and it doesn't react, turn it up. And it's going to be very reactive. Hello, this is the sound of neon. Yeah, enough of that. Um, yeah, that's it. Very cheap again. Um, these are separate items, but I got them together so I could use them. Um, and yeah, it's really cool. So that is it for today. If you enjoy this, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed yet, uh, please do so, uh, and don't forget, don't forget to hit that bell so you get notified of all the future update videos that I will release, which will no doubt be even more post bags from AliExpress. Cheers, guys.